Are you ready for the Bitcoin halving? Maybe you're not sure what the big deal is, or maybe you don't know what the halving is altogether. Either way, you're in the right place. Let's start with what the halving is. One of the purposes of Bitcoin mining is to fairly distribute the 21 million Bitcoin. Every block mined creates new Bitcoin. As of the recording of this video, 6.25 Bitcoins are distributed as a reward for every block. That means that roughly every 10 minutes, 6.25 new Bitcoins are added to Bitcoin's total supply. Since there can only be 21 million Bitcoins, the amount distributed each block is reduced every halving event and will eventually go to zero. Every 210,000 blocks, or roughly every four years, the block subsidy is cut in half. This is the halving. This means that after this upcoming halving in April 2024, mined blocks will be awarded 3.125 Bitcoins. 210,000 blocks after that, each block subsidy will only be 1.5625 Bitcoins. Then it will only be 0.78125 Bitcoins. And this will go on and on until the block subsidy is nothing. All Bitcoins will finally be mined in the year 2140 and miners will only earn Bitcoin rewards from transaction fees. The factors that drive how the new subsidies will impact miners' profitability are difficulty and Bitcoin price. To further understand the impact the halving will have on miners, let's look at previous halving events. To date, there have only been three halving events. If we look at a historical halving chart, we can see that the price of Bitcoin greatly increased about a year after the event. While this has proven to be the case over the previous three halving events, it should be noted that past events are not always an indicator of future outcomes. There are a lot of factors that go into Bitcoin bull runs, but theoretically the halving plays a large role in this price increase. On one hand, Bitcoin becomes more scarce, increasing its value and potential demand. On the other hand, miners need twice the amount of hash rate to mine the same amount of Bitcoin they were mining previously. This also means twice as much power and therefore electricity costs. Some miners, especially solar miners and miners with higher energy costs, will find that mining Bitcoin is no longer economically viable for them. Knowing this, it's important to prepare for the halving. As mining difficulty increases and halvings occur, it's important to manage your fleet's efficiency regardless of whether you have 1 or 100 machines. Each year, more efficient miners are produced that produce more Bitcoin for less when compared to older models. For example, S19J Pros have an efficiency of approximately 30 watts per terahash. The brand new S19K models have an efficiency of approximately 24 watts per terahash. This approximately 20% improved efficiency in mining Bitcoin makes them better equipped to mine competitively pre and post halving. If you're a Compass customer, please reach out today so we can analyze your current mining hardware and explore where we can enhance efficiency prior to the halving. If you're not a Compass customer already and would like to learn more about how you can mine Bitcoin, please check out our website for more info and be sure to follow our channel to stay updated on all things Bitcoin and Bitcoin mining.